Well, howdy y'all. Hopefully you can hear me okay. It's uh, one of them weird days. I say, oh, there it is. I got my little baggie here. My little baggie plugged into my chest. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um, I wanted to answer a couple of questions because I forgot to. So a couple of people had commented. Um, one person asked about uh, this guitar here. Um, and it, no, this is, a, this is a Harley Benton. And um, these things I've been wanting to get my, my hands on for a long time because they... Uh, they have amazing prices. They, uh, I keep hearing amazing things about the guitars. This is another Harley Benton. Um, this one was definitely under $200. This one I had to purchase along with that one because I looked at it and I was like, holy crap, are you kidding me? This is like just over $150. This is actually a carved top. So this is carved here. It's got a comfort card on the, carve on the back too. Um, it's got the gold hardware, but it's got the, it's a, a Pal Ferro um, fretboard. Uh, my... The one that I bring to the the hospital for my infusions, that one's got a Pal Ferro key, uh, fretboard on it, and I like that one. And it's got, you know, the two humbuckers, which I, I completely love in, in the tellies because it gives you that fatter sound and everything, and uh, it was just a nice looking guitar. And then, then the uh, down here, the, the string through is just a little bit different as well. And I thought, you know, damn, these guys are, are putting some thought into sub $200 guitars, and you know they're they're if, if they're as good as they look, then uh, I gotta try it. So they finally got on Reverb. They now have a United States store. Um, what happened when I first found them? It was before, right before COVID, and shipping was it was you know like do I want want to really want to pay forty bucks for shipping from Germany? And at the time I was like I don't think I really want to. I really should have, because right after that when COVID hit. Um, the shipping went up at least 90 to over, you know, like $120 for one guitar. And it's like, you're selling me a guitar for $120 and you're charging me 150 to ship it to something's wrong here. So, you know, um, that's why I, I never bought one. And now with their, their store on reverb, they are a couple of dollars more expensive than you would find on their German site, but it's free delivery right now. So that's why I said, huh. And there was this other financial thing. I did a real world thing. It was like, you know, you got to build your credit up. So you have to have um, installment plans. So that's why I got the two of them because it was just a super good deal. And it was like, okay, fine. Well, you know, I can make these payments and we'll see if we can get my credit score up just a notch or two. So. And then today, you know, with uh, with all this stuff, I did want to talk about this because I really didn't have anything. I have things I'm working on to play. Um. That one won't come out good. Uh, don't fear the Reaper. Uh, Oyster Cult. I do not have a cowbell, though, so maybe I should wait on that one a little bit. But uh, but uh, one, of the, one of the songs, and this is just weird, because at the time when Saturday Night Live came out, I was seven. Seven? No. Five, yeah, seven. Um, if it came out in 75, I guess I was seven. Um, uh, but I one of the things that the, the house band, I don't even remember who the guitar player was at that time. Why don't I remember that? But uh, oh, it was uh, what's his name? He's got an amazing guitar collection too. And then the slide kicks in. It's. But that's a mother that I found out later on. I had no idea what the song was, but I just loved the riff. I mean, that that opening riff. And go listen to Eric Clapton play it because I listened to it live. Listen to it live and him putting all sorts of distortion and just feedback behind him and him going. <laughs>
Anyway, I just love that that. <laughs> And it's just off an A, man. Just off an A. Anyway, my chemo pump day, I'm probably not making any sense to anyone. Uh, I still would like to uh, ask for subscribers. I'm, I'm out here trying to do this every day, man, even with the chemo pump, just to prove that it can be done, that I can get through this. And... Have a smile on my face and keep progressing and keep, uh, you know, trying to keep getting better. And... One day I'll be a rock star. Yeah. Always look up, man. He's there for you. I'll see you then. Have a great day. Peace.